hi guys how are you welcome back to my channel my name is Irene Tila and this is the Irene Tila cooks in case it's your first time to post on this channel you are very much welcome and here guys for those who are new here we usually do lots of cooking we have some fun and so much activities so if you love such content you're very much welcome just press on that word subscribe and join this amazing amazing channel and for those who subscribe to my channel over my last video thank you so much and you're very much welcome <laughs> and please subscribe to alafu wende ama upote subscribe and then be coming back to watch my videos be coming back to have fun with me and my people <laughs> will subscribe to now when they guys always be coming back so on today's video i'm going to be doing a cooking video kama kawaida and i'm going to be sharing with you this popular recipe guys go hata nashanga kwa nini sijawahi fanya hii recipe on my channel so today i'm going to be preparing a meat a meat recipe guys and um it's a favorite recipe for my grandmother actually anapenda kupika nyama yake this way so it's a recipe that I've grown doing it or preparing meat this way so kama kawaida if you are using data ongeza bundles <laughs> this is and then if you are using wifi please don't touch that dial and tell a friend to tell a friend wapigie simu wambie tell them about this Irene Tila cooks tell them about the recipes just tell them everything about Irene Tila cooks <laughs> So kama kawaida let us just jump straight to the video and let us do this together. Yeah so guys uh, let's get started and um kitu ya kwanza ni nyama <laughs> and this is my meat actually it's um like a half half a kg so my meat and uh, always remember to wash your meat the first thing you wash your meat, don't assume that you will pick a single nyama. You wash, like this one mine was already washed. And then I'm going to place it uh, into my cooking pot. Namlahivo. And I'm going to cover it and let it cook until you my Juliosha nayo. Ish. It has been cooking and it has not been cooked for a long time. Come on, like uh, three minutes even. So let's check. Actually, to add it to Maisha. To add it to Maisha. Hope you can see inside. So, a kisha ibo. I'm going inside the meat or in the pot with my cooking oil. And then I go in with my chopped onions. Now, Bitungu, don't worry about um, how we should slice them. Mama is in a card. So, mine, I chose to cut them this way. Just turn and cook the onions. Going in with my garlic. Pounded garlic actually. <laughs> and cook the garlic. Either pea and I so brown. I don't like um, garlic any jaiva. I don't like that um the taste. But ikiva in a kuwa tam zaidi. So you also cook the garlic. So 
so it's at this time at this point i'm going in with my spices and now my first spice is the paprika kadogo too paprika just to bring the color and then my royco cube the beef one and then kasoy sauce <laughs> I'll tell you the reason why uh, they are just some things I've added actually about the soy sauce because soy sauce itself is salty hey. so I took it to bring the color and then at this time also is when I'm going to add some some salt The dog got too. And feel free to add in more spices according to your, your taste, that you like, Luna Penda. Don't be limited about the spices. So that is it. I hope you can see my Vitungu Kila Kitu Zimeiva Vizuri. So, Unakuja hapa kwa waru. So hapa ndiyo my shosha na ingilia. Sasa kama nyama haina waru, iyo si nyama. So that is it. Kidogo tu, don't overdo. Na ikatutu waru kidogo. I hope you are seeing guys. So like that. Let me show you inside. So it's at this point. I'm just going to spread uh, my tomatoes. Just chop tomatoes. It doesn't matter. Blow my chop. Like that. And then we cover and let the tomatoes zive zibondeke and then we'll come back later. So let's check our tomatoes. Tomatoes na fazi hivi zibondeke, so you can just pound pound the ones that are not yet. Zila zija hivi, you just try to gonga gonga them. So that is it about the tomato. So it's at this point I'm going now to add little water just to enable the potatoes zive vizuri pia nazo na pia nyama yetu iendele kuiva. Maji, to be full. So now I'm heavy. I'm going to cover it, and then to watch it. Iendele kuiva, especially for the potatoes. The beef has been simmering for some time, guys. Let's check and see. Imeiva amabado. Imeiva <laughs> and hope guys can see how it's looking. Yummy yummy. 
And guys, be careful when making this. Uh, the potatoes you see, the zikabondeka, zikaluzi yo. The potatoes being inside the kabondeka. So be very, very careful. Hope you can see. So let me serve kidogo. Unfortunately, leo nita test amuta, amuta niona. Thank you so much for watching this video, guys. And I hope you'll try this simple. It's a popular recipe, guys. You can try it at home. You can share it with your people. So that is it. I hope you can see how it's looking on my plate. And for this stew, guys, you can have it with some rice, chapatis, or even ugali, guys. It's not limited that it was specific food. Vile unaipenda is the way you'll take it. So thank you so much for watching this video. Thank you so much for your company. Thank you so much for your time. I really, really do appreciate that. And see you on my next video. Bye.